Hey, this is Nicholas Wilton. So uh, I just arrived here at the studio and um, had a big resistance to getting here. And I was thinking as I was riding my bike in this morning, how, uh, how sometimes it can feel really hard uh, and, and uh, to, to kind of like do your art when you love doing it, but it can be really hard. Some of the things I've noticed uh, in my own practice is that kind of like the less I do, the less I do, there's this kind of tendency. And if I haven't done much art in a while, like let's say I go on Christmas vacation or whatever, it seems to grow. Uh, the difficulty, uh, the challenge to coming in, to starting again, seems to get bigger the longer I wait. Um, it's just kind of an interesting um, observation. I don't know if this is true for you. It's certainly true for me, and I've talked to friends about this, and they, they, they concur. But um, I, what I want to share with you today is just kind of how I uh, kind of work around this, and I kind of break it down in my head to sort of, it helps me get in here. And I like to think about it this way, you know, when you're, the, the challenging, the hard part of, of making the art isn't so much when you're doing it. It's actually not hard at all. I mean, it can be kind of hard sometimes, but I mean, the real sort of pit in your stomach, that only happens when you're not working. That only happens when you're thinking about working. That procrastination, that kind of, I don't know, there's a bit of like frustration that you can have. and. Um, but that's not when you're working. So now I just like to think about, you know, I don't have to worry about, you know, th those feelings. That's not what the actual art making is going to feel like. I like to think about the art making as, you know, I have complete freedom. I get to work with all these amazing colors. I mean, if you can think about, you know, this as a possibility, so you know, like, this is what I get excited about. Like, wow, I get to use these. I get to make whatever I want. And in a way, the art making, that half an hour, that hour, that two hours that I've squeezed into my day where I turn the phone off and I, you know, I get to just do this, um, that, really, that really provides this almost like a vacation from your life. So your art making can be almost like a vacation. And if you just realize that the, the thing you're worrying about doing isn't really hard. It's the worrying about doing it that creates the worry. And to just let that go, just all you have to do is get there. And don't waste your time worrying about it because once you are there, then you can have this really great experience. And, and we all know this, you know, once you're in it and it starts to, you know, you get so much feedback from it, it's, it's, it's rewarding, it's super satisfying to make art. We all know this, but sometimes I've, I've found that it's just, there's a little like work around to, to actually getting in the studio. So, you know, think about your art making as a vacation and, and just let that not be something you dread because that actually is really true. Anyway, that's what I've been thinking about. Um, you know, I'd love to hear your comments. Thanks for listening. Okay.